Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Get Fishing 365. I am back at this damn waterfall combination here. Ready to make another video. Uh, another nice warm day. It is February 2nd, uh, Groundhog's Day. So happy Groundhog's Day to everybody. Um, quick shout out to my wife. She's in the car. Um, without her, none of these videos would be possible. She is my main transportation to pretty much every single one of my fishing locations so without her none of this would be possible so thank you so much babe I appreciate everything you do for me but without further ado let's get fishing get my net got a couple setups today let's see uh you know what I'll bring all three We'll bring all three of them today. I think I'm gonna start out here where I started last time, and then I might sneak over to the other side. So, they kinda just plowed everything down here. <laughs> so, looks like somebody already made their way down here. I'm gonna try to use their old footprint. That wasn't too bad. Oh man, this looks nice. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and lower these poles down like last time. <sighs> so I'll work my way down here. Maybe I'll start out with this one. Okay, my last video, this is where I was. Um, if you haven't seen my last video, I'll have a link to that in the description below. Um, I'm using my seven foot Berkley Cherrywood rod. I have on my Abu Garcia Max X20 reel. I'm using um, six pound fluorocarbon. And I have on a little bit of a leader line because I have on a barrel swivel to uh, prevent line twist. And this is a white um, one 24th ounce rooster tail with the silver blade. Here we go. Like I said, it is February 2nd, Groundhog's Day. And if there was a day that I could relive over and over again, like that movie, it would be a day of fishing. First cast of the day. Let's try to get out there a little better. There we go. It's about 30 degrees. Try to do another quick fish. Well, I got the wife waiting for me. Fish on. Nice. First fish of the day. What do we got here? Get over here. <sighs> Looks like a little brook. Yeah, it looks like a little brook trout. 
Hold on, little buddy. There you go. Nice. What a cool little fish. All right, let's try to get another one. Hopefully a little bigger. Something was nipping at it. Got him. Fish on. I think it's another brook trout. If I can get him over here. Come here, buddy. Yep. Another brook trout. Oh, unhooked himself. There we go. A little bigger than the first one. Nice little guy. What a beautiful little fish. Gosh, I love trout fishing. There we go. Nice. All right. Two out of this spot. Not bad. Since this is a short trip, a couple more casts over here and I'm gonna move. Gonna leave this pole here since I'm gonna travel a little bit. <sighs> Look how beautiful this looks. Gosh, the scenery on it, just on its own, is amazing. Look how clear that water looks. I don't know if the camera can see that, but that water is just crystal clear. How gorgeous. It's so beautiful. How good somebody else. 
This made some tracks. Maybe I'll try going over there. Yeah, I'll try over here and Hands are getting cold. Here's some tracks right here. Like a bunny. All right. Thinking I'm gonna try right here. So yeah, we have my six foot Eagle Claw spinning rod, my Dawa uh, Sweet Fire 1000 reel. Um, I have 12 pound fluorocarbon as my main line. I have a liter of six pound fluorocarbon, the barrel swivel to prevent line twist. Exact same one, just a little bigger. Yeah, one eighth. I'm gonna get out on this rock ledge here and cast from that or at least get up on it perfect Oop, got snow on my reel Fish on, fish on guys, yeah, yes. Oh, I was about ready to give up over here. Oh, it's a nice brook trout. This is the biggest one of the day, you guys. Oh, nice. Oh, that's the biggest one of the day. Oh, unhooked himself. Look at that, guys. That's the biggest one of the day on the second setup. Nice. Third fish of the day. Nice little brookie. Let's get him back. Nice. Nice fish. Yes. <laughs> well, good thing I made the switch up. All right. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for me. Time to call it. All right. Like I said, guys, time to get out of here. Had a great day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had a great time making it. Only caught those three fish, but still was a great day. Um, for Groundhog's Day, I would repeat this day over and over again. It was an awesome day. Uh, until next time on, let's get fishing 365.